What's up everybody? Blank from Intercalibur. Gonna be starting a little video series looking at some of the fundamentals, protocols, and giving a few ideas for people at maybe the lower ranks on how to defend and take certain spots and certain places on different maps. Today, we're gonna be starting off from T side on Inferno and going up to B or taking banana control. Um, we'll discuss more once we get into it. And we're back. So first of all, we'd like to thank our partner, Frostbite Networks for sponsoring or being our partner for our service and we are going to be showing how to take a banana or getting to top banana control from T-side on Inferno. Also we are joined by Barnacle and we he, we're going to try and help him and show him some basics. What's up? Where are you? Yep. Uh, Barnacle. Oh there you're in the server already. How's it going? Uh, um, um... Don't ask me that question. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> Good. So we'll try and show you a few things. We'll try and keep it short and sweet. You're gonna have to cut this. Yeah? You, and you're ready? No, it's cool. We'll keep it. You're ready? spectating me, which is great. So we'll quickly run through here. So, a thing for... A important thing about taking B is having the fastest spawn. And normally, the person that spawns somewhere in this area will get the fastest spawn. So, round starts. This is going to be like the, the super fast version of it. So, just buy some missile. You would run. Try and avoid the walls. Try and pull out your util as you get to the corner, throw it while running. This is very important. It is a very strong position to molly as it cuts off CTs trying to push and peek you. And if this is molly, they're going to be like, nope, and they're going to run away. Ooh, absolutely so, not here. Exactly. So I'll let you have a run through it all, but I'm going to do the super quick, like a bridge version. So you throw that molly while the molly is still burning. If they somehow are brave enough to throw their util down, if you hug Ooh. this wall here, you will be safe from all their nades coming and fireworks over your head. Then, <laughs> exactly, yeah. So if you hug the right wall, so you can imagine, molly will be here, you will be running up here. If they molly somewhere here, you just put underhand throw, this will extinguish any mollies, and then boom. You can fight a little bit, clear your corners, and I mean, you know the molly will be here, and you basically take control from over here. This is like the most important area, you just kind of chill around here, and this is where your top, like, B control ends. Going further than this is kind of where you start to hit sites, but that will cover in a different video. So I just want to show you the super basics, give you some, like, big confidence for this. Some other big things from here, taking top banana control, people love hiding behind these sandbags over here. So what you do is, if you are somewhere here with a molly or nade, depending on what you have and your teammates, if you throw things against this little uh, rafters window type thing here, like that, it bounces quite nicely, and there you go, congratulations, you are an elite player. <laughs> so, what would you call that area where... Uh, sandbags. Uh, where the, okay, like sandbags. sandbags. He's hiding behind sandbags or something. Cool. Then two piece, good pieces of useful when you do take sight eventually, which is not so important for today, is this is your CT smoke. It's like really basic. You just pull out from here, normal throw. I'll show you where it lands. And then your coffin smoke, wedge yourself in this corner, use this knob and this knob, line them up there, and just throw. Oh, that's cool. And that's where that goes. Oh, Ooh, that's terrible. Ooh. Sorry. Ooh. That needs to go <laughs> far left. But this is a good example. So this is bad. Don't do this. <laughs> Okay, um, I want you to spawn and have a few runs through it, and I'll be your eyes and ears. Is that spawn about here? Yeah, okay. uh, somewhere there. Oh. Okay, so cool. You got the first spawn. All right, guys, I'm going to take B, get some control. You get your, pull out your molly already. Ah, okay. Pull it early, throw it, run. run. Oh, yeah. would I run cool. back? Yeah, no, you keep running. You keep, you're taking control. You've already thrown the molly. Okay. And, uh, so and if they have... A smoke? Yeah, just throw so loosey goosey. Yeah. So you can right click throw it. Because yeah. now you would Oh yes, because that's an underhand. You would have, yeah, we go. Because you don't want to kill your, your vision that you've kind of yeah. just been fighting, right? Okay, okay so that should oh, be that. Now that I've done that. Let's find a way for these to dissipate. And now yeah. let's try those two. Well, let's try the, that, that molly into the top of sandbags. When the smoke dissipates, you'll just kind of line it up and do that little running throw as well. Assuming, you know, this is maybe later in the round. There we go. Per. Perfect. Okay, uh, let's, let's go through those two smokes. Your CT and your coffin stick. smoke. Yep, just wedge yourself in. Pull out Line. a little. Perfect. Now show me how to do the coffin smoke properly because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Let me d allow me to demonstrate. Please do. So you line up these two knobs, right? Over yeah. here. And then you just pull it a little bit. Okay, okay. The sure. moment of truth. You run faster with your knife out as well. Oh, look at that. You you grenade better if you if you actually Perfect. practice. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> yeah. So this should just help yeah. a little bit with your confidence already, and that those are some big plays. Um, the last thing I wanted to show you, if you go back towards your spawn, um, how, what is your movement like? Your your right. jumping and your KZ. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or as some people call it, the smooth movement. Would you like to find out? Yeah. So there's a little jump you can do. I'm sure you've seen it before. Do you know about it? The, from the barrels in front of you to the wall, like right here, right here. So oh, if you stand on the barrels to your left, you take your knife out, stand on the barrels. Okay, moment of truth. And then you're gonna run and jump and then crouch in there and land on the wall. It's it's a little sneaky thing, but it is really useful for getting... <laughs> oh, okay, two more. Two more two attempts. More. Otherwise, this could be a, a long run, a long video. Oh, what is this? <laughs> Who does that? Okay, well... <laughs> okay, no, beginners like again, again, again. Well done. Oh, but really? Yeah, okay, so, okay, so, okay. So, okay. this is really useful when for like after plants or just getting control. Oh, I knew it! Okay. Oh, did you? <laughs> but anyway, this could be a while. Thank you everyone who watched this. I hope you found it a little bit informative. If you would like to be part of the next one, or if you want something a bit more detailed, or something a little bit more complex, uh, Barnacle is fairly low rank. Um, so for him, this is hopefully going to be beneficial and he would have learned something. Um, yeah, if you definitely very useful. Awesome. If you do have any questions, just shout. We can always do another one. Maybe the next one we can show you how to take more of um, B or a different spot on the map, or CT side even. Show you the opposite yeah. of this. Awesome. And that is a wrap.